This video is going to be on my Gamo P25 Tactical, which is a 16-shot uh, pellet blowback pistol, CO2 pistol, of course, with a really long barrel. Uh, accuracy is not too bad at distance, you'll see, hopefully. And I like this pistol. Uh, kind of reminds me of, uh, I don't know, like a, gro a Glock grip angle and the size of it, you know, it's smaller than the PT-85 or the pistol is, I should say, a little bit. And uh, it's kind of a rarity here in the States. You don't really see the uh, P-25 tactical very often. Um, but next up is the uh, velocity test. Temperature is currently 80 degrees. The pellets I'm using for the velocity test are the RWS R10 match, which is a 7 grain lead watt cutter. Wow, I can't believe that. That first shot was 700 feet per second. That's crazy. Next is the accuracy test. I had the distance set at 15 yards. I'm gonna fire five shots using the same pellet, the RWS R10 match. Let's go have a look. Again, 15 yards. Not too shabby. Especially with a CO2 pistol with a really strong blowback. Last, of course, is going to be the shooting test. I gave myself a uh, pretty good challenge. I've got five soda cans down there at 30 yards that I'm going to try and take out. I'm giving myself 16 shots. I know that may sound like a lot. It actually is a lot. But um, it is at 30 yards, and I didn't practice for this. So everything you see in here now is pretty much cold except for the five shots for the uh, velocity test and the five for the accuracy test. Um, I give myself a 50-50 chance of hitting one of them. Um, don't, I doubt I hit all five, but who knows? Who knows? We'll see. So let's do this. One. That's two. That's <laughs> three. Let's push this over. I'm losing all my pellets. Two more.
I got four out of five at 30 yards with a CO2 pistol. Yeah, I know it has a ridiculously long barrel, but uh, I did it. I'm surprised. Uh, I guess we can go look at the targets real quick. And being at this distance, I wasn't not accounting for uh, height over bore. So you can see I was shooting kind of low. I tend to only remember height over bore when it comes to a rifle. Kind of suck when it comes to a pistol. And out of the shots, uh, that one's out, that one's out, but not too bad. My final thoughts on the Gamo P25 Tactical. I like it. Granted, it is a lot of pistol, just like the PT85, but uh, you know, I like this over the PT85. Um, I don't know, it has something to do with the grip, the way it feels. Um, and also, this pistol is somewhat of a rarity. Uh, you rarely see the P25 Tacticals um, more overseas as opposed to here in the States. So I'm kind of lucky to have this one, or I feel kind of lucky to have this one. Um, you know, 30 yards, I did hit four out of the five cans without practicing. Uh, I think I did pretty good. Um, yeah, I did miss a lot. But overall, it has a strong blowback. Um, the magazines are eight round at each end, standard, just like the standard P25 and the uh, P PT85. But again, like I say, this is kind of a rarity uh, for the P25 Tactical and I do like this pistol and I plan on uh, holding on to it for some time and other than that uh, yeah that's it